In the current climate of the COVID pandemic, commercial gym centers are facing increasing pressure to implement safety measures that protect members and staff. The importance of disinfecting your gym center cannot be understated, as this will help protect you and your members from the risk of contracting COVID. There are six key rules that gym owners should implement to keep their members safe and healthy. 1. Sanitizing all commercial gym equipment. Regularly sanitize all commercial gym equipment, including treadmills, weight machines, and free weights. This can be done using commercial disinfectant solutions or with simple household products like vinegar or hydrogen peroxide. 2. Cleaning the entire facility. Ensure thorough cleaning of the entire facility on a regular basis, including washrooms and changing areas. This is especially important after large groups leave the premises. 3. Requiring members to sanitize their hands. Require all members to regularly wash their hands both before and after working out. Hand sanitizer should be readily available throughout the facility. 4. Encourage to wear face masks. Encourage members to wear face masks while working out, especially if they cannot maintain a safe distance from others. 5. Limiting the people that can enter the facility. Limit the number of people who can use the gym at one time in order to maintain social distancing guidelines. This may mean implementing a reservation system or requiring members to pre-register for their workout times. 6. Advise members to stay home when they have COVID-19 symptoms. Ask members to stay home if they are feeling ill or have any symptoms of COVID-19. This includes fever, coughing, and difficulty breathing. Symptom checkers should be set up at the entrance of the gym for anyone who is feeling unsure about their health. By following these simple tips, commercial gym centers can go a long way toward protecting their members and staff from the threat of COVID-19. However, it is always important to stay up to date with the latest guidance from health authorities in order to ensure that all safety measures are aligned with the latest recommendations.